How you doing? We're taking video off. Good thing, see. What's that? No, thank you. And here's a security truck guy. And they're telling you to come over there. Just walking down the trail taking pictures. What's that? Are you law enforcement? I work here at Clark County. And you're not law enforcement? No, I'm not law enforcement. No, I'm not going to have no idea. Just stay by If you're not law enforcement, I'm going to keep going about my business. Hey everybody, Gunnison Undercover here. We are down in Lacey Township, New Jersey. I'm not alone today. I brought my... Uh... Filming is legal moron. Right. He's my new partner in crime out here. He's the only one so far who's stepped up with a set of balls. Well, Police State has stepped up too, so I can't, I can't complain about him either. So we've got three good auditors here in New Jersey. And we are looking for more auditors. So if you're in New Jersey or you want to come to Jersey, Give me a shout, gunnisonundercover at gmail.com. So where we're at right now is we are on Route 9 here in Lacey Township. And this says, welcome to the Ostrom Station. Don't know much about it, but I can tell you this. There is a county trail, and that trail down that way takes us right past the Oyster Creek nuclear plant. And if you saw Police State New Jersey's video, he was met with Rambo out there, and Rambo got shut down. Lacey Township Police showed up, and everything seemed cordial, and that was that. But me and uh, this crazy guy right here, he doesn't know what he's getting himself into with me. Uh, he, we're going to go down there. We're going to walk down that trail, and uh, we're just two bros out. Out for a ride. Two bros out for a ride on a beautiful fall day in New Jersey. It's about 50 degrees out. It's starting to get a little chilly for me, but... It's still a good day to do an audit, and we are mobile on our bicycles. I've got my bike. If you remember that bicycle, that appeared in the Manchester video. And Bruce here has himself a brand spanky new bicycle. It's, uh, last time I took my friend here out on an audit, he had to do a lot of walking, and he has back problems, and uh, it, it was tough on him. We don't want him to... Uh, we, had to go, we had to go to bicycle route. Uh, yeah. Four mile hikes just aren't cutting it anymore. Right, so we we want to we want to accommodate our orders as much as we can. So today is Saturday, November fourth. Uh, what time you got there, son? It's uh, just about five minutes to one. Okay, five minutes to one on Saturday, and we're going to head down to the Oyster Creek via the County Trail. I just saw the sign here. So the, the official name of this trail is the Barnegat Branch Trail and it belongs to the Ocean County Parks and Recreation, paid for by the taxpayers. And there's the trail, and we're gonna go down that trail right now. We got maybe a half mile, three quarters of a mile to go, and we'll be in the vicinity of what we're looking for. All right, if you know what this is by now, this is an entrance to the nuclear plant. there is a camera. They're watching us. We're watching them. And right up there is a guard shack. Sorry about the moving around here. Yep. As you see, we're still on this trail. Here we are at the Oyster Creek Nuclear Generating Station. Out here with guns and undercover. We're doing a follow-up audit to uh, an audit that was done.
Okay, I just noticed this star tower right back there. Look at that one. Imagine Jobs is sitting there all day long. It's got to be pretty boring. I got some deer went, went by. by. Here we are at the gate of uh, this Exelon Generation, that's uh, known, also known as the Oyster Creek uh, uh, Power Generating Station. We're at another entrance. Let's see what this says. This property is protected by an armed security force. Visitors must immediately contact the site representative. Vehicles are subject to search. Well, that's nice. I don't think anybody's coming through here yeah, easily. Exelon Generation, or used to be generating station. Uh, as I mentioned before, I'm out here with Gunnison Undercover. Uh, as a result of a audit gone, gone wrong on an earlier occasion uh, with an armed guard, uh, we're here to see uh, if they've known them. We still got some distance to go. There's another entrance we're waiting to get to. So as I'm going along the trail here, what do I see? I see poles with cameras. And as I always say, you're watching us, and we're watching you. Gun is in undercover. Cameras everywhere you go in this world. Everywhere you go. Cameras. Still got a little more ways to go get to the uh, the main address. And we got more of these. up there. And we're going to go through this little covered bridge right here and continue on our way. Got a little sign right here. Notify Oyster Creek Security before entering. There's the number 609-971-4954. In case we have any problems, we know who to call. Another nice little inlet outlet here. There's a good shot of the power plant. And we have a guard tower right there. So far, everything's going pretty good. camera looking right down this way. So I have no doubt they know we're here. And so far they're not responding. 
and that's what I want. And Bruce is still with me. So we're just a little bit south of the power plant. I'll be turning around at this point and going back. So far, we've walked all the way down to the south end. And nobody has bothered us. And that is fantastic. Maybe Police State New Jersey taught them something. Or maybe Rambo isn't working today. And the guy that's on duty isn't drinking Red Bull. So we've been to one end of the other. No police, no security, no nothing. All right, folks, we made it back. We're back to uh, where we started, right there. And uh, I think Bruce is bringing me good luck because uh, every time he goes out, it's the second time, nothing's happened. I'm truly amazed that somebody didn't just come out and say hi to us. Uh, no, nothing. Absolutely nothing. Huh? So, I'm going to give that credit to Police State New Jersey. He's the one that had a deal with Rambo. I was looking forward to Rambo. I really was. But it didn't work out that way. And I'm happy it didn't work out that way. And that's it. Uh, if you're not a subscriber yet, please subscribe. Support the cause. You know, rewrite the narratives now, not them. And if you want to be an auditor, grab a camera. Don't sit there and think about it. Do it. This man right here was one of those guys that thought about doing it. And thought he, about it for, for two, three years. And uh, he got inspired. I, I can remember Jeff Gray, Tom Zebra, all those guys yeah. with the camera in the authority's face. And I said, damn, I want to do that, but I'm just I'm afraid. I can't do it. I can't go out by myself, et cetera, et cetera. I think uh, he's still afraid, but that's okay. <laughs> yeah, a little bit perhaps. But, uh, yeah. but you know what? He was inspired. Whether I inspired him or Jeff Gray or one of the other guys, the point is that we inspired him and he's doing it now. We just got to get him into a situation where he's got to think with an encounter. So far, no encounters. And I really thought this Oyster Creek was going to be a high target and give us uh, some action, but nothing happened. Yeah, we're zero for two on the encounters now, so, so uh, I don't know. Uh, maybe I have some cop kryptonite, who knows? <laughs> So anyway, support uh, Filming is Legal, Moron. That is uh, Bruce's channel. He's an up and Like and subscribe. Right. He's an up-and-coming auditor, so we got to support him. we all, all got to start somewhere. He's fortunate he's got somebody to mentor him. I didn't have a mentor. I just had a. I just had to, the drive to do it, and the gall, the balls to do it. So here we are. So anyway, folks, thank you for supporting the channel, and we'll see you next time.